Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we're watching the Clone Wars movie, which was released back in 2008. All right, just FYI, I have already started watching the Clone Wars series and I have seen the Malevolence arc, which I believe happens after the events of this movie. So I'm actually ahead of few episodes compared to the time frame of this movie, but I've just decided to watch the movie. So this will be like watching a prequel to some of the stuff that are, I've already seen. But I'm excited to watch the movie, but before we go ahead, leave a like on the video, subscribe to my channel, and hit that notification bell to get the latest updates. And without any further ado, let's just dive right into the movie. I like the sounds, you know? I guess there's a war happening. Oh, we got the galaxy line in a galaxy far, far away. A galaxy divided! Striking swiftly after wow. the battle of Tiana. The opening shot is epic. Love it. Crime Lord Jabba the Hutt's son has been kidnapped. What? <laughs> Jabba has a son? We must help Jabba. This is the opportunity we've been looking for. The Jedi must rescue Jabba's son. I don't like why Palpatine is being so nice. Something's wrong here. But what choice do we have? The Huts control the Outer Rim, and we'll need their space lanes in order to move our troops. Wow, the Republic is dependent on Jabba? How powerful is Jabba? I mean, I knew he was powerful, but that's crazy. <laughs> the only Jedi we can spare are Skywalker and Kenobi. Those are the only two we need! Oh, they're still on Christophsis. Gotcha. This is the medical station that was uh, attacked in the Malevolence arc, or a similar one. R2-D2 is back in action. Let's go. I love this back. planet. One of my favorite, you know, worlds. Cody, battle positions. Commander Cody's here. Nice. Wow, this battle looks even better than what they had in the episodes, you know? I mean, the TV show. Sure, I guess it's a movie, so there has to be a higher budget, I think. Follow me. What? They can't jump like you? Oh, they have... <laughs> okay, okay, they can fly. Why would you try to punch that battle droid? <laughs> This battle is done so well. Wow. I love the action in this one. We're gonna need reinforcements. We haven't been able to get oh, through been... to the Admiral. Oh, they haven't been able to make contact? So the others don't know what's happening here. We must pull back and set up our deflector shields. Who is this guy? Looks like help has arrived. Has it? You really think it's a good idea to bring a Padawan learner into all this? I spoke to Master Yoda about it. Are we gonna meet Ahsoka? Padawan would just slow me down. Okay, so Anakin does not want a Padawan. Yep, there she is. Hey, R2 is excited. The battle reminds me of the battle on Coruscant. On, in episode 3, the movie I mean. Revenge of the Sith. We are trapped here and vastly outnumbered. We are in no position to go anywhere or do anything. Our support ships have all been destroyed. Okay, they're in a bad shape. I'm the new Padawan learner. I'm Ahsoka Tano. Ahsoka Tano. I'm Obi-Wan Kenobi, your new master. I met your Wait, she was master supposed Kenobi, to be Obi-Wan's? But I'm afraid um, I've actually been assigned to Master Skywalker. Yeah, Padawan. What? No, 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 no. There must be some mistake. He's the one who wanted the Padawan. No. Master Yoda was very specific. Oh. I'm assigned to Anakin Skywalker, and he is to supervise my Jedi training. Okay, so Yoda assigned her to him. Let's check on Rex in the lookout post. You better take her with you. <laughs> He's stuck with her now. Okay, now it's making sense why they have the back and forth that they have in the later episodes you know a few episodes after this point he will be safe here ventress nice soon the jedi will not only be at war with you count 
but the hut clan as well. Yeah, I knew there was something fishy about Palpatine being excited about the opportunity to support Jabba. So I thought you said you'd never have a Padawan. Yeah. <laughs> There's been a mix up. The youngling isn't with me. Stop yes, she is. That. You're stuck with me, Sky Guy. Oh, <laughs> what that's did you just what call she me? <laughs> Don't get snippy with me, little one. Okay, now I get the story behind Sky Guy and Sniffs. Gotcha. Captain Rex will show you how a little respect can go a long way. Yeah. Sky Guy. <laughs> then technically I outrank you, right? In my Not book, yet. <laughs> experience outranks everything. Well, if experience outranks everything, I guess I better start getting okay. some. Okay. She's enthused about it. That's good. That's a good thing. Well, I, for one, <clears throat> agree with her. Oh, he does? They will march forward under the protection of their shield until they are right on top of our cannons. Wow, they're not very far. You think they have a chance? They better. If they can't turn off that shield generator before it reaches the heavy cannons, there'll be no escape for any of us. Okay, so... Anakin and Ahsoka's first mission together. Greater than we think, this mystery may be. Go with the fleet to aid Master Kenobi. I will. Okay, Yoda's joining the fight. You were the one with the plan. No, I'm the one with enthusiasm. Yeah, <laughs> I won't disagree with that. My first lesson will be to wait while you come up with the answer. What? Why so cocky? She's a little too cocky for just being a Padawan. And a youngling. But it's funny, sure. What? <laughs> No one's noticing that. <laughs> That's jokes. We still need this thing. I can't take I it anymore. I think you do. I have to stand up. Come on. <laughs> there it is. Come on. Wow. Almost the entire city is in that shield by this point, I guess. These shots of these cruisers just arriving out of hyperspace are always fun. Love, always love them. Forget about the droid. Set those charges. She needs to listen. Just a while back, he said that he t she takes directions properly. That's just gonna activate more of them. Yeah. Sorry. Whose side are you on anyway? Yeah. <laughs> no, 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 no. Oh. Okay. She works perfectly with Anakin. This is something that Anakin would have do himself done. I just saved your life. Yeah, after endangering it. Ahsoka is just annoying right now. <laughs> I guess it's okay. She's a teenager. <laughs> it took him way too long to understand Obi-Wan's strategy. You're reckless, little one. You never would have made it as Obi-Wan's Padawan. Yeah, she's reckless for sure. But you might make it as mine. Yeah. That's a good line. Okay, so this is how they met. And became, you know, Master and Padawan. Eh, she's happy. Trouble you have with your new Padawan, I hear. Not anymore. With a great deal of training and patience, she might amount to something. Okay. Something makes me think this was your idea from the start. <laughs> Oh, it was. Let's just hope Anakin is ready for this responsibility. All right. Red, master this. Skywalker. Master this. Skywalker must. Skywalker must be fuming. Don't say the word master in front of me. <laughs> so he gets a Padawan without him being a master because grant him the rank of master we do not. Okay, we're back to Jabba's lair. Just a Domingo level. It's nice to see this worm after a long time. They better be if you want the Republic to have safe passage through Jabba's territory. How's he gonna spin this one? So Anakin will be going back to his home planet. What about the bounty hunters? Are they still down there? I don't think so. We haven't seen them in a while. <laughs> You're not gonna see them again. How did Jabba get the shield down? Okay, so there's a wall behind him. Okay, she's bragging about the whole campaign. She is such a teenager. Time to teach you that a Jedi is humble, yeah. my young Padawan. Sorry, just trying to keep the boys inspired. Really? That's what you were doing? 
<laughs> Keeping the boys inspired. I'm sure Jabba's in a good mood. Bring him a slave girl and he will be. Even if he's not. Alright, so Obi-Wan is meeting Jabba the Hutt. Nice. Oh no, these guys. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> he demands you bring back the slime who kidnapped his little punky muffin. Punky muffin? What? I don't like it. Prepare to attack. Uh, one of it's one of ours. Shut up, Sergeant. I'm in command here. Finally, one droid who takes things seriously. Oh, oh my God. Get back here, Sergeant. Get back here. <laughs> Those things can scale walls? I mean, like slopes? Damn! That is impressive. I would take one of those, you know, bikes that they have. Yeah, Anakin is taking them. Blasted Ahsoka, I told you to stay close to me. She's right behind you. I can't get much closer, Sky Guy. Yeah. The droids have done their part. Oh, Ventress is right here. I like this monastery. It has a nice ancient look to it. Not a place for a servant girl. Do servant girls carry these? <laughs> she got so offended. I'm improving your technique. <laughs> of course, you did miss one. I did that on purpose. Sure. <laughs> sure you did. He's a lot younger than I That's thought he'd be. That's a baby be. hut? Oh my god. <laughs> Just wait until you see what he'll grow into. Yeah, can't deny that. No argument there. Dooku was right there. No one noticed him. Oh, of course, he's wearing a cape. I have discovered it is the Jedi who have kidnapped him. What? Since you think that smelly larva is cute, you're gonna kill. Yeah. <laughs> How do you like your little buddy now? Still cute? I thought he smelled. See? You're two of a kind. <laughs> Maybe you should carry both of us then. We've got to get him back to the ship immediately. Jabba the Hutt's son has fever. As you can see, it is the Jedi who have your son. Wow, Duke has played this perfectly. This is Christopher Lee's voice. I am 200% sure. I love his voice, by the way. If you let anything happen to his son, our chances of a treaty with him will disappear. Okay, I definitely do not want that baby to die. That was a close shave for R2. Our mandate was to get this hut back to Tatooine, and time is running out. All right, Snips. I'll trust you on this one. Captain, hold them here as long as you can. Okay. Anakin's letting her take charge. Nice. The red one? No. The blue one? No. Not that one. What? <laughs> of course. Come out of there, you grubby little slug. <laughs> <laughs> nice. I don't talk to separatist scum. You will contact Skywalker now. Yeah. I will contact Skywalker now. Oh, no. Anakin, come in. Anakin? We've held the droid, sir. That's not like Oh, that's... that's a good point. Okay, okay. You must hold them off until I finish my mission. Do you understand? Yes, sir. I mean, ma'am. Uh, sir. Launch all fighters. They don't sound confident. I'll see if I can find Captain Rex. Come in, Rex. You copy. Rex is not in a good place right now. I remember the jungle was a bad place. Compared to Ventress? I don't think so. Ventress versus a youngling? There is no way Ahsoka, you know. I mean, I know she survives it, but. Should I tell him they got away or what? <laughs> He's dead, yeah. Why? <laughs> Just relax, Oddball. I'm right behind you. Oddball? I've heard that name before. Yeah, Oddball, do you copy? Form of your squad right up behind me. I remember that dialogue. Commander Cody, prepare the gunships for ground assault. There's a lot of action in this movie. I mean, many things have happened until this point. 
there's that whole Christophsis arc, and then this is happening, and it's just been like an hour. Surrender, Republic dogs. We've got you outnumbered. There's a lot of comedy in this movie, by the way. Apart from all the serious scenes. Did I remind you whoever gains Jabba's favor will control the war in the outer rim? For your sake. Master Kenobi, always chasing after Skywalker. What's even the point? Why let droids after a Jedi? Now let's get Stinky out of here. Uh, if we can. Oh wait, this is the ship! I always find the uh, design of the ship funny. Like, why is it not symmetrical? I know, I, I get it, like it's space and everything, but why? That ship's so weird. <laughs> Master Kenobi is here. Now we'll see some real fireworks. Excuse me? Yeah. What do you call what I've been doing all day? I don't know. The word reckless comes to mind. Very funny stuff. That applies to you too. They're bickering like siblings. We're not going to be able to help you. The mission always comes first, sir. I like Rex's attitude. have to do better than that yeah it was a nice trick but that's not gonna work against obi-wan shall we continue my pleasure <laughs> what's with all the niceties between these two i feel like if they weren't on the opposite side they'd be best friends or something <gasps> whoa they must think this grease bucket is an enemy ship okay so it's a crap ship but Anakin keeps using that ship after this point. Imagine that you're sick and you're in a ship that Anakin's flying. <laughs> I'll be puking. That changes our plan. Whoa, what? Looks like we're gonna have to take this bucket of bolts all the way to Tatooine. So they're going to Tatooine in that ship. Okay. I like the fight between these two. It's really well done. I don't think he's gonna make it, Master. There's gotta be something we can do for him. As ugly as that thing is, I don't want it to die either. Wow, that was such a cool shot. With the moons behind them. Master, if you've taught me one thing, it's that nothing is easy when you are around. <laughs> what? Is that supposed to be a compliment or an insult? Oh. He does not look excited. <laughs> By the time we were able to find Jabba's son, Skywalker had already killed him. Killed him? Oh my god, these guys. They're able to manipulate these guys so easily. Duke was a really good manipulator. Your son to win your trust. That's crazy. How he can just spin things around. I will deal with Skywalker personally. Oh, along with those guys. I was hoping I'd never have to lay eyes on this dust ball again. Okay. What happened? Long story. Even you have to admit he's cute when he's asleep. I admit I like him better when he's quiet, <laughs> but only a little. All the guns are locked in the forward position. And they have no rear deflector shields. <laughs> All he needed was a nudge. Morph, did you get shot down again? Yes. Ahsoka, stop being a tattletale. It can get a little rough. Crashes are rough. Landings are not. It's a crash landing. Huh. Crashing into sand? Sure, that's not as bad as, you know, crashing directly on ground. Jabba will send out his bounty hunters to see that he is dead. Allow me. I have much more experience dealing with Wait, Jedi. we're about to see an Anakin versus Dooku fight right now? Join Dooku in the Separatist Jabba Wheel. Yes. That would be a disaster. I'm sure he wants that disaster. Anakin's experience with the Hut should help. He'll come through. Yeah, he's from the same planet. Oh, there she is. Padme's here. Anakin, is he in danger? I'm afraid the Jedi's efforts to strike a secret trinity with the Huts have gone terribly wrong. I wonder if... I wonder if Palpatine knows about Anakin and Padme at this point? Jabba the Hutt has an uncle in the old downtown area here on Coruscant. 
Perhaps I can reason with him and reopen negotiations. Please, my dear, I beg you. Chawa has an uncle. Oh, we're we're getting to know a lot of Chawa the Hut family. <laughs> These guys, they're gonna strip that ship. I'd like to see a Jedi from this race. That would be fun. What is it, Chronos 327? My mission to the 12th moon of Yao. Is that the uncle? <laughs> Use him for spare no. parts. No. No. Getting back to business. No one cares. <laughs> Wow, it's just an endless desert. There's so much more we can talk about out here. Like the sand. Oh, don't get him started on the sand. <laughs> it goes everywhere. She can just escape through that? Oh, of course, it's not a jail. Your plot is coming apart, Count Dooku. A senator from the Republic was here. What? He is in with Dooku? Kidnap Jabba's son. Don't worry, I have convinced Jabba that the Jedi have murdered Of course his son he is. On, then the mighty Jedi Order will be forced to bring Jabba to justice. And you, my friend, will be left to take control of all wow. the clan. That is a good plan. I was just leaving. I'm sorry, that cannot be permitted. Yeah, now. obviously she can't leave now. You will regret this, Zero. His name is Zero? He's gonna get exactly zero dollars. I mean, whatever currency there is after this. Ah, uh, the two sons. It's good to be back on Tatooine, though. I have a far more important mission for you. More important than keeping you alive? Ahsoka, I need you to trust me on this one. Yeah, he's not kidding with that. What's that? Don't touch that. Whatever you do, keep away. They're gonna touch that. Help. I'm being held by Zero the Hut. Oh, that was a nice. Okay, that was her plan all along. Wait, Tatooine has three moons? Okay, Dooku and versus Anakin. Surrender the hutlet or die, Skywalker. There will be no wasting time. Oh. Okay, so these two fight it out after the, uh, I mean, the events of episode two. Every time Dooku meets Anakin, Anakin is stronger. This was your home planet, wasn't it? Yeah. <laughs> You failed, Jedi. Oh, thank God that Java Stinky is with Ahsoka. Three of those guys? Wow. That's a challenge for sure. This lightsaber fight is cool, by the way. Look, I have a message from your brother. Ahsoka has a very unique way of holding her lightsaber. She holds it the opposite way, you know? Three against two. Stinky, you watch my back. Stinky's gonna watch her back. That baby has gone through so much in one day. It's unreal. I believe you are too dangerous to be kept alive. She's too valuable to be killed. Who's coming for her? Run for it. Surely he means crawl for it. Master! Oh, he's here. here! Alright. Your son is not with him. What? Your son's not here? Oh, he doesn't know Asuka is not here yet. Oh, she didn't hear her before. What have you done with my Padawan? Okay. All right. <laughs> your uncle will admit he conspired with Count Dooku to kidnap your son. Okay, that should get. Okay, I guess he'll release Anakin after that. Zero! I don't know why, but Zero actually looks younger than Jabba. I would have never guessed that he's his uncle. Jabba agrees. A treaty is in order. All right! A treaty is in order. Dooku has failed again. Damn. It's a series of failures for Dooku. Our fight has become far more difficult. Allow the Jedi their small victory, my friend. Of this war turn in our favor. Wow. Just wow. Palpatine really sees the big picture. 
We never actually got to see Yoda fight in this. Alright, that was super fun. I actually went into this movie without any expectations because it's just that this movie is not talked about a lot. I wonder why though. Because I'm definitely enjoying the series and the movie was, a, was quite a fun watch. It kind of pleasantly surprised me. Of course, I love the fact that there were a lot of familiar faces in the movie. That always helps. And I just checked the credits right now and Count Dooku was indeed voiced by Christopher Lee. I love his voice. I just checked right now and Count Dooku was actually voiced by Christopher Lee. While I love the voice of the person who does Count Dooku in the series, uh, Christopher Lee's voice just hits different. It has a different feel to it, it has a different gravitas to it, and I absolutely love it. She's one of my favorite voices ever. Okay, so this movie was Ahsoka's introduction and, you know, the way she meets and I guess becomes a Padawan of Anakin Skywalker. I like the way their relationship progressed during this movie because a lot happened in this movie. I mean, we saw like three, four different planets in one movie, which was crazy. She was a bit overconfident and too cocky at times, but I guess it's okay. We gotta let it go because she's a teenager. And now coming to what I did not like in this movie, hmm, there are a couple of things. First of all, I don't understand the point of this movie in the first place. It looks very similar to the Clone Wars series. I don't understand why, you know, this particular plot was taken as a movie instead of splitting it in different episodes and just, you know, adding them to the Clone Wars uh, series. Because it's not like the movie is a massive upgrade in the computer graphics department, because the war scenes were great, but the style of this movie is very similar to what we've seen in the Clone Wars series. The whole animation style is very similar to the show. I understand that for a show, that there would be budget constraints, for especially for a show, completely animated show that is six, seven seasons long. So I don't really have a lot of complaints about the animation style for the show, even though it can be a little bit rough around the edges at times. But having the same style for a movie was a little bit underwhelming. Did you guys think that? I feel like the target audience for this movie was more on the younger side than adults. My only last nitpick would be, I wish there was a little more Yoda action in this movie. I got excited when he mentioned that he'll be joining the fight, but we actually didn't see him in action. It was sad. After his couple of scenes, I don't think he even appeared in the movie until the very end. But that was a fun watch. Don't get me wrong. I really liked the movie. Uh, I would, if I had to rate the movie, I'd give it like a 6.5 out of 10, you know? Uh, so yeah, I did like the movie. But thank you for watching it with me. And if you can, please leave a like on the video, subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell for the latest updates. And I will see you in the normal TV show reactions. Bye.